Hi, my name is Elaine Caparola and my company and product is Drum Tea. Drum Tea is a percussion drum and cymbal mute that I developed and uh, manufacture. In 2010, when my youngest son was seven years old, he uh, received a junior drum set and um, we were concerned about his hearing, so we started looking for drum mutes right away and um, I was very surprised to find that there was really nothing on the market that was acceptable for muting drums. Especially there was nothing at all for junior drum sets. So uh, the, primarily what they had on the market was the foam rubber type pads that you put on top of the drum sets uh, and they kill the rebound of the drumstick. So I started um, experimenting with different fabrics for mutes and I came up with my product which is a drum and cymbal mute. Um, this is the mute that would go onto a cymbal. This is the type mute that would go into a drum. They're made for any size, they're very durable, and they're made for junior drum sets too, which there was never a market for that. Um, in 2011, I filed a provisional patent knowing that there was nothing else on the market like this. In 2012, I filed my full patent and it issued in June of this year. So um, with that in hand, I went into a drum shop. I went to Dale's Drum Shop in Harrisburg, PA, which is one of the largest um, independent drum shops in the world, and um, talked to the manager there, and he liked the product, and I was in my first retail store then, and that was just weeks ago, and within a week, uh, Dale's Drum Shop reordered. So things are picking up and going in the right direction for me. I'm hoping to be able to get... Um, the support I need to be able to market this and um, do this in the U.S. so it can be made in USA. Um, we have a website, uh, drumtea.com, and you can also go to uh, Dale's Drum Shop in Harrisburg, PA, and try them out and buy them in person. Um, when I invented this, uh, my intention was to create a mute that was um, better at muting drums and helping drummers retain drumstick rebound. What I found through my customers and my son's use is that they're also uh, very useful for recordings. Um, they're a great way to fatten a snare drum. They're useful in performance as well. I had a Canadian artist um, purchase some and used them on a recent recording of an album. And shortly after that, the producer contacted me and they're now used in that studio. So I'm excited about the product and hoping to grow it and um, keep it made in USA. Thank you for watching.